We've since learned through Israel's official Twitter accounts, they posted the names of those that were slaughtered on October 7th, that over half of the individuals killed were military personnel. This was even shocking news to the BBC smear artist propagandist that was interviewing me and trying to write a hit piece on me. He said, really? Are you, you making more stuff up? Half of them were military personnel? Prove it. So I sent him Israel's official government posts stating that all the names were listed and over half of them were military personnel. He was shocked. Maybe that's why they didn't run the article. Then we learned through another a uh, really crucial piece of evidence, uh, Israel admitted that some 200 of the bodies that they said were Israeli civilians that were killed by Hamas were actually bodies that were, Isra uh, that were, that were uh, Hamas, and they were badly burned, so we didn't know they were Hamas terrorists. Take a listen. We had the number at 1,400 casualties, and now we've revised that down to 1,200 because we understood that we had overestimated, we, we made a mistake. There were actually bodies that were so badly burnt, we thought they were ours. In the end, apparently, they were uh, Hamas terrorists. So the question then...